Welcome back to realvacantland.com. This is Luke Smith. I've got another property for you. This one is in Texas. It's in uh, Medina County, Texas. It's just west of San Antonio. Um, it's got this lake really close to it. This is a picture of the lake that's near the property. And uh, let's take a look at this one. I'll show you what we have. So I brought up the map. I was just looking at the map on realvacantland.com. And towards the top of the page, if you go to realvacantland.com, there's a link down at the bottom uh, in this description that takes you to realvacantland.com. There's a map search. And so I'm going to this map search part of the website here. It's just, you know, it's titled map search. And you get this map. If you let it load, it takes a little bit to load, but then it comes up. And this is a map of all the properties that we've got up for sale on the website. The green ones are for sale and the red ones are sold. And a lot of people ask, you know, why do you keep the sold ones up there? It's because people are always looking for the property. <laughs> and these, each one of these ads has the descriptions of how to get there and the property lines and information about the property and stuff. So after you buy it, it's still nice to be able to go reference that information. You can figure out how to get there. You can just click on it on your phone. Just like this ad, we zoom in here. This part of Texas. I'm, I don't know if you notice. I'm zooming in. I was going to tell you about the area on the way in. But uh, we've got the Gulf of Mexico over here. Here's Houston. Here's at San Antonio. So like I said, just west of San Antonio, this is um, Medina County. And we've got these lakes here. So this is the, this is the lake. Medina Lake. And so towards the northwest end of the lake, there's a neighborhood. I don't know what this neighborhood's called, Holiday Villages or something. And the names of these roads all have numbers. Um, the name of the road that this one is on is Private Road 1510, Private Road 1510. So on Private Road 1510, towards the north end of the road is this lot. And if we go and we go to satellite, we could look out, look at this thing. Excuse me. Um, so it's a lot here and we'll zoom in, we'll look at it closer. But this, this map search of the website allows you to look at properties in relation to each other. Because a lot of people are always asking, you know, is it next to it? Is it near there? Where is it? Where's the property? I'm looking for one over here. I'm looking for one over there. And so before I created this map search, I don't know how I ever answered questions, but this map search makes it a lot easier. So you can answer a lot of your own questions. So there's power lines going down this road. There's power lines going down this road. I don't think there's street view here. Um, I mean, there's street view going past the into the neighborhood, but not, not into the neighborhood. So the area looks like... Uh, you know, smaller trees. Okay, it looks like it's a gated community. So here's a gate getting in there. Um, holiday villages, resort communities. So it looks like there's a guy at the front, you know, golf cart people. If you talk to them, they'll probably take you to the property. You got the Texas flag out there. Let's see what it says. Um, can't really read it. RV and left over two weeks must something. I don't know. They've got some rules. You can probably call them and see what the regulations are, but they've got mailboxes out front here. Let's click on it. Let's take a look at this property. So the, this one is for sale by um, Curtis, his picture is right here. He's got his phone number here. So if you go to the link in the description of this video, you can get his information. Curtis Ikaloff, Ikaloff. I'm going to butcher his name. Sorry, Curtis. <laughs> Just call Curtis. Phone number 254-338-2451. He's had numerous properties on the website in different parts of Texas. Um, you've probably seen uh, different properties of his in my videos over time. Um, just a stand-up land dealer. So it's this is a quarter acre, 0.28 acres, just over a quarter acre. It's Medina County, Texas. He's asking fifteen thousand seven seven seven. Um, so just over fifteen thousand dollars. And he's got some pictures. This looks like a picture of the neighborhood, and uh, going down to I don't know where it's going down to. I don't know what the point of that is, but going to like uh, San Antonio, it's about an hour. 
hour eight, hour nine, hour 20 different routes, a little over an hour to get to San Antonio proper to get downtown um, to go to Anderson Lane, Austin. Okay, here's Austin. To get to Austin, Texas is about a two hour drive to get to Austin. So you could come here for the weekends and stuff from Austin. Here's a picture of the lot line. So just across the street, you can see that they've got their fences set up. So it lines up with the guy across the street that's got the horseshoe driveway. But it's on this side of the street. There's a power pole right there at the corner. And it looks like there's a transformer on it. And it looks like the guy across the street's getting power off of that transformer. Um, that's going to be really close. So you probably don't have to get a new transformer or a new power pole or anything. You probably string from that power pole straight into the house. Um, you know, let the power company do that. But that's probably pretty cheap and easy setup to get into power it looks like there's mobile homes in the area people are doing mobile homes um, some people are building houses it's a mixture of houses and mobile homes um, and I think there's some RVs too I mean it kind of looks like a mixture of mobile, ho mobile homes RVs and houses yeah so Here's the lake right over here on the side. So this community is on the side of the lake. So I'm guessing it's got some community access to the lake. But either way, you're really close to the lake. I'm sure you can go, go catch some fish for dinner in the lake. Take the kids water skiing or something. Looks like there's some boat houses out here. Um, you might be able to rent a spot in one of these boat houses to keep your, uh, keep your, keep your boat on the lake. You don't have to take it in and out all the time. This looks like a shot from, you know, from the water. It's a part of the lake. Okay, so I think we're going in circles on the pictures there. Um, Curtis has a buy now button. Let's see how that's set up. Oh, he's going for the full amount. 15777 going to Shelby Land Deal. So this goes straight, this money goes straight to him. It doesn't go through, through me or anything. It goes to him. You're buying from him. He's for sale by owner. And um, I'm just presenting it to you. He's asking for title, tax, dress, contact information. Click, 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 and it and it goes goes over to him. It's got GPS coordinates. If we click on that, it should open it up in a map. Yeah, so it takes us to a map. If you click on that in your phone, it should give you driving directions to the property. And um Property tax, $266 a year. He's got GPS coordinates of the of the property. He's saying it's basically 120 foot by 100 foot. Um, there's another map showing the property. So I got a lot of people asking for land in Texas, especially land in Texas you could put a mobile home on uh, with power. And this one looks like it's got power. I'm guessing water and other utilities would be there too. So it's it's got what a lot of people are continuously ask me for in Texas um, drive up and hook hook up a mobile home this one's near a lake it's not that far from Austin or San Antonio so I think it's worth checking out that's why I wanted to present it to you today take a look at this property I'll put a link in in the description below to go look at it and feel free to go look at it in person um, look at it on the internet look at it however you want call Curtis ask some questions thanks for listening thanks for watching if you want to see more videos like this about other vacant land Please hit subscribe and I'll keep presenting more vacant land properties. Um, if, if you can't wait for the next video, take a look at ruralvacantland.com. We've got hundreds of properties scattered across the United States. Usually the cheapest in the area. Really easy to buy and start using vacant land. Thank you. Talk to you guys later. Bye.